Hey everyone, welcome back. I'm Ritu Gill. I'm here to cover two Chrome extensions for OSINT researchers. Let's see how you can use the verification extension called Fake News Debunker. It's up on the screen right now. And how you can use Forensic OSINT side by side. So let's go to the Fake News extension that you see here. This can be used for reverse image searches. And if you go to Forensic OSINT, this can be used for capturing and saving online content. So let's jump right in. I'm going to do a little demo. So if we were looking at this photo here and during your research, um, you want to know, hey, what is this? Where is it from? Well, this is where the verification plugin comes in. I have it installed. And from here on a photo, I can right click and just click on that plugin. And now I can either do a reverse all for all of these sources or I can pick whatever one works for me best. So I'll try a reverse image search with Google. And you'll see how quickly and how easy they make it. Um, it does the reverse image search for you. And right away, it's a place called Science World. That's why it's, it's, it's identifying. And you can see here are the results. Um, so next, uh, what you can do from here is click on Forensic OSINT. And you can capture current screen. Or I'm going to just say capture full page. And I have it set to 20 screens. This is something that can be adjusted in your settings. So here that's finished. You can see that here's the screen capture, the URL is captured, the hash value, the date and time. You can scroll down to see what it looks like. And then you can move over to the right and you can download the capture and turn it into a PDF report. So one thing I want to mention here is when we're using the plugin uh, for verification, the idea is when you're doing a reverse image search, you're trying to see if that image exists somewhere else online, or you're looking for a similar image, or you just want to identify what it is. That's what reverse image search can help with. Um, and you can see that it quickly gave those results. They do call the verification extension the Swiss Army knife of fact checking because it has several uses. Um, there are other features. Another one that I'll point out um, today is if you right click again on the extension, you can click on image magnifier. I use this quite often because it allows you to zoom into the photo, the background. Sometimes I've used it, uh, you know, looking at plate numbers closely. So it might be able to identify um, features on a building or a sign, that type of thing. So that's another use case for using the verification plugin. So once you've done that, again, going back to Forensic OSINT, if you capture that content, it's there, it's preserved. You can use it for further analysis or documentation in general. Um, and today we just covered quick tips with using a verification plugin um, for that reverse image search or magnifying a photo. Um, and then Forensic OSINT to capture any relevant content as you go along doing your research. Uh, thanks so much for watching today and stay tuned for next week's video.